we felt it was very important to continue to give back to the community and especially in the recent times that we've had. We think this will be something positive for the community and also, you know, to keep the Bears roots alive here. This year, South Carolina State Fair is going to look a lot different. Due to the coronavirus pandemic, it will switch from its usual traditional look to a drive through setup on October 20th and the 21st. Our fair industry has really been devastated through the COVID-19 pandemic, and so uh, many of them are, are, have already been held, or supposed to have already been held, and have been canceled. So we're all looking for ingenious ways to do things. Nancy Smith, the general manager of the fair, says families will be able to drive through the fair and check out animals, art, history, and other exhibits. There will also be an exhibit to honor the recipients of the $300,000 in scholarships the fair gives out to graduating seniors every year. There will be no rides for safety precautions. Food favorites will also be available for pickup. Smith says this is a big deal for vendors who have been hurting during the pandemic. They've really um, not had anything to do because the vast majority of fairs have been canceled. They were have actually been calling us prior to this to you know check in to see if we knew what we were doing. So they're very excited about it. Smith believes this is the safest way they can have the fair and have something positive for the community to look forward to. Your South Carolina State Fair staff has spent countless hours in trying to develop the safest and the best fair possible for everyone to come and enjoy and after many hours of that it became obvious to us you know that the drive-through fair was really the only way to do that so um, with our social distancing and wearing masks and all of that um, we just feel like that this is the this is absolutely the best and the safest scenario and that people can be able to come out um, you know and feel good about it and enjoy some time at their South Carolina State Fair. So yeah, I posted this on Instagram earlier today. Are you going to check out the drive through fair? And so far, the response has been interesting. Um, obviously, safety first in everything we do. But I know for so many people, the fair is a family event. It's that one time of the year when everybody gets together. Um, and so it's a little disappointing that it's going to be different this year. but. We also know this, the fair is huge when it comes to scholarships, Andrea. Darcy, forget about um, uh, get-togethers. You and I have been at the fair together for what, more than a decade? I mean, that has been your and my thing that we have done together for almost 14, I guess this will be our 14th year, I think. Um, so I'm certainly going to miss the traditional fair. Yes, I will do the drive through fair. I don't exactly understand what that means. I wanted Miss Nancy to go into a little more detail. Now, does this mean I can get my little bag of the miniature donuts with the cinnamon and the sugar all on them in the drive-thru, or can I just look at exhibits in so, the drive-thru? So I've got the answer to that question because I've looked into this. Um, so the exhibits and okay. um, the art and all of the other stuff outside of rides will be on the drive-thru route. You can order your food in the parking lot, and then you can pick that up as you leave. What about fried mushrooms and the ranch? I feel like all of your favorite food vendors will be there, Andrea. You will not miss out on your chance to and get a fried bologna sandwich this year. <laughs> we have so much history. And don't forget my, my dollar Otis Smokemeyer cookies and my white milk and um, my Fisk fries and my Daly's corn dogs. So I've got a very long list of things I gotta do at the drive through fair. I'm gonna get a lot of cash and I'm gonna make my order and I might be the first person in line at the fair. But